I think this is an important game changer for New Hampshire families. Again, we saw how impactful the child tax credit was during the pandemic with the passage of the American Rescue Plan. Um, that middle class tax cut uh, helped out 77% of New Hampshire families. And just six months after uh, that credit was expanded in 2021, uh, we saw child poverty drop by 30% in the United States. And we know how that made a difference in New Hampshire uh, as Granite Staters got to keep more of their hard earned money uh, each and every month. So I'm really glad that we were able to come together to pass this tax credit. Uh, the bottom line is that this is going to put more money in the pockets of New Hampshire families at a time where we know that costs remain real high. Uh, costs for a variety of things that people rely on in their day-to-day -day lives, whether it's groceries, whether it's energy, whether it's the cost of child care, and we'll hear a little bit more about that later. Um, this legislation will provide meaningful relief to Granite State families, uh, and I've heard through the years about the impacts that that makes uh, in terms of people getting back to work to be able to fix a car, uh, not having to choose between uh, grocery bills or fixing a leaky roof. These are real stories that have been related to me from constituents across the district. And I'm just grateful that there's another group of folks who are here today who are going to talk a little bit more about their own stories uh, and uh, share some support for this legislation too. So uh, we're not yet across the finish line with the bill. Uh, this was the first major step. Uh, it now goes to the United States Senate, uh, but um, they have been part of the bipartisan negotiation around this legislation um, to date. So uh, I think we should expect uh, a positive outcome here uh, in the final analysis and hope that the president signs it into law real soon.